Hi Year 3, Mrs Hardy here. Hope you're all okay. Right, I'd like to introduce my ECA extracurricular activity, Predator Model Making. So, I'd like to show you first of all just some ideas. So as you can see, there's a cardboard tube tiger because as we know, a tiger is a predator. So if you like the look of those, you could possibly try to make one of those. I've also found a lovely crocodile. I think this is amazing. This is a really good example of a junk modeling predator crocodile. Use whatever materials you have at home, but please check first. Please ask mums and dads at home if it's okay that you use the things that you found at home. Just check with them. Say, is this okay to use? And then go from there. So gather up some cardboard rolls, some boxes. If you've had any deliveries, um, you could use the boxes. Find, see if you can find some egg boxes because they're very interesting shapes. Um, paper, lolly sticks, wrappers that you might want to use. Anything that you can find to use at home to help you make a predator animal. I've got another crocodile here. This one is smaller and as you can see it's made for the most part for its body out of a cardboard tube. So you're going to need some scissors to help you cut things. And you can see on this one as well that there's some paper being used to make some legs and spikes and teeth. I've also got, <clears throat> excuse me, a paper plate. And you can see on there it's pasta. So it's been painted. They've used pasta. So have a look what you've got at home. What could you make? So you need to think of two things, what you've got available at home, boxes, tubes, paper, and also think which predator animal you would like to make. Make your model as bright and colorful as you can. Decorate it using paint if you have some at home, colored paper, whatever you've got that you think you would like to use to make your predator nice and bright. Now, Bayard in my class, he made an excellent example of a predator using things he's found at home. This was absolutely fantastic. He's made an amazing model. He also found some facts about his shark, about the predator he made, and then he presented those facts in a little video. It was fantastic. I was so impressed with it. There's a great example of what you could try. Have a look online if you want to do a little research, if you want to do some more research for further ideas. But be creative. Remember to check with an adult if it's okay to use what you've found. Have fun.